Hi there, everybody, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2, Claire's side of Leon's scenario. Now, it's funny. I used one green herb from here. It boosted me back over. Ran in, didn't kill the zombies in the room with the detonator. Got bit twice. Used the green herb in there. Wasn't enough, so this green herb brought me up. So all the green herbs are now used. Now, where am I going? That's easy. The hallway that has the downed helicopter. I have the C4. I ran and grabbed the detonator before recording. I did open this, right? Yes, I did do that. It gave me that slate. Which, very shortly, you're going to see exactly why I need those slates. And I know, I've been on a big Resident Evil kick. Still haven't found a lighter, so I can't get the second red gem to put in that room with the liquor. Alright. Right, gotta combine them. For a lame-ass explosion, by comparison to what C4 should do. But... I mean, it's an old video game. Can't expect too much. An old but amazing video game. And now I'm in the chief's room, and the chief is right there. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> I thought you were another one of those zombies. Are you Chief Irons? Yes, that's me. And just who are you? No, don't bother telling me. It makes no difference. You'll end up just like all the others. That's the mayor's daughter. I was told to look after her. But I failed miserably. Just look at her. She was a true beauty. Her skin nothing short of perfection. But it will soon putrefy, and she will turn into a zombie within the hour, like all the others. There must be some way to stop it. In a manner of speaking, there is. Either by putting a bullet through her brain, or by decapitating her completely. And to think that taxidermy used to be my hobby. But no longer. Please. I'd really like to be alone now. <laughs> sure, dude. Sorry, I was eating some chocolate. As I was straightening up the chief's room, he burst through the door with a furious look on his face. It's only been two months since I've started working here, and that's the second time I've seen him like this. 
Last time was when I bumped into that statue, only this time he looked even more agitated than ever. I seriously thought for a moment that he was going to hurt me. <coughs> I finally discovered what the chief has been hiding all along. He finds out that I know my life will be in serious danger. It's getting late already. I'm just going to have to take this one day at a time. And then nothing on that page. Wait. Let me go. Easy, easy there. I'm not a zombie. You're safe now. <laughs> My name's Claire. What's yours? Sherry. Do you know where your parents are? They both work at the Umbrella Chemical Plant, near the city limits. The chemical plant? Then what are you doing here? My mom called and told me to go to the police station because it was too dangerous to stay at home. From the look of things, I'd say she was probably right. But it's dangerous here as well. You'd better come with me. But there's something out there. I don't know what it is, but I saw it. Much larger than any of those zombies. And it's coming after me. What was that? That's what I was telling you about. It's here. Sherry, wait. My controller was acting weird. So, yes. We've now met Sherry. And you have heard William screaming again. So this time when I go down to the sewers, instead of actually fighting a... child? I'll be fighting William himself. Through a different way. Chief? And the chief is gone. But I now have the heart key. His diary. But there's also where the slates go. Chief's diary. It's all over. Those imbeciles from Umbrella have finally done it, despite all their promises. They've ruined my town. Soon the streets will be infested with zombies. I'm beginning to think I may even be infected myself. I'll kill everyone in town if this turns out to be true. I was successful in spreading confusion among the police as planned. I've made sure that no one from the outside will come to help. With the delays in police actions, no one will have the chance to escape the city alive. I've seen to it personally that all escape routes from inside the precinct have been cut off as well. There are several survivors... Still attempting to escape through the lower levels, but I'll make sure no one gets out. I've had a change of heart about the remaining survivors inside the precinct. I've decided to hunt them down myself. I shot Ed in the back through the heart less than an hour ago. I watched him writhe in pain upon the floor in a pool of his own blood. The expression on his face was positively exquisite. He died with his eyes wide open staring up at me. It was beautiful. I wonder if the mayor's daughter is still alive. I let her escape so I could enjoy hunting her down later. I'm going to enjoy my new trophy. Yes, frozen forever in the pose I choose to give her. So yeah, the Chief Irons is exceptionally creepy. Alright, so I have green and red. Now, where should I go? Okay, I can easily go that way. As you can hear, Big Boy isn't there. 
So he does disappear. He doesn't chase you anywhere like the remake. the ammo off him, right? Yes, I did. Okay. Increasing key is now useless. Thank you for freeing up my inventory, you pain in my butt. Noted. Green herbs. This is the hallway I... Is it broken here, too? Okay, club is that one. Wait. Hold on a tick. I have those two doors to go into first. I'm gonna do that before dealing with the basement. Let's be smart. serves. I killed all the zombies out here. Because they were just getting in my way. the liquor was here. Well, it would have been here, but I killed him. I do remember that. It would have broke through the glass. I'm gonna grab the... Ah, son of a... Bugger, he's still there. Just go away. I thought I killed him. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I left him. Right, that hallway. That's right, I'm a dummy. Okay, that's the two-way mirror room. And yes, I did jump, because I thought I'd actually taken him out. I forgot that I didn't. Running away, running away. And when I was looking through good old games the other day, I didn't realize it, but they actually have the original Resident Evil on there. For when I beat that. Ah. Okay, come here. Where, where, where? Uh, you want to this. I should be taking out some of these heads. Don't touch it. But I am trying to save as much ammo as I can, even though I might not necessarily need it. Control report, that's the same one that you get when you're Leon. You know, I'll grab them because they're here. Worst case is I can just discard them. Get off the ladder. 
scrapey, 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 scrapey. Yay, the lighter! Now I can do the red jemmy thingy. Oh god, I'm hurt. I am hurt. I am hurt. I am hurt. I am hurt. I'm limping. I'm limping. I'm limping. They touched me inappropriately, everybody. Oh, that's why I got this. Oh crap, I almost ran right into him. And I had completely forgot, if you don't take out all zombies in a given room... If you don't take out all zombies in a given room, they will respawn. Thing. Give me the red gem, please, and spank you. Because I want to take care of that. Would you just come here? You know what? I'm annoyed. Don't have to come through this hallway again. At it, I can take care of those slabs in Chief Irons' office. All the backtracking, all the backtracking. No, I am completely going the wrong way to the gem room. <laughs> oh, I am so dumb some days. Uh, 
Well, that was a waste of some of my acid. I hate you for that. There we go. Ruby in the bust. Ruby in the bust. Part of a slate. Because I am going to still have to go down to the basement. There's no way to circumvent going to the basement. broken one, I can't actually slide in there, even though, you know, I kind of wish you could slide it in there, leave it there, bring the other broken piece in, and then stick it in there. No, you gotta combine it in your inventory. Alright, so... Yeah, I know what I'm doing. I swear I know what I'm doing. I'll be back for those. All right. So I still need the key card. All right, have to be sure. Parking lots. Don't want to go down there yet. First thing I want to do is come in here. Mainly because this room usually has, aside from healing items, at least some form of ammo. I thought. Apparently, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Though that would be surprising. Alright. Club key, that's right. the ladder and I get my butt handed to me by puppies. Safe room, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. I'll just store the broken piece for now. Save inventory space. And this is the one weird thing I find, especially with Claire. Her bow gun. When you play through her scenario first... Sherry... I've been looking everywhere for you. I was so worried. We've got to go now, honey, okay? If we stay here, that monster will find us. Let's go. No! I won't! What's the matter? <laughs> Don't you trust me? 
It's not that, Claire. It's because of my daddy. He's over there. I heard him call my name. Daddy must have been attacked by the monsters. I have to help him. Wait, Sherry. Don't go alone. Sherry! Sherry! And now, similar to when you were Ada, you are now Sherry. And similar to, like, Resident Evil 4, when you're the president's daughter. By the way, the zombies can't actually, uh, bite you. You're too tiny. So they can't actually grab you. They can only barf on you. So I don't know which is worse. Hup, hup. Same puzzle as before. Hup, hup. Hup, hup. Yeah. Kudos for her having the muscles to do that, for being so little, because you don't know if these boxes are full or empty. I'm assuming empty because they float, but still. Kudos for this kid being able to push them. Well, sometimes when you climb with her, her leg slips. It's a neat little thing that's basically like, yep, they're a kid. They're not going to always do perfect stuff. Should be the same as last time. Yes, we got the club key. Now, I'm just gonna go to the other portion past the zombies, make sure that I'm grabbing everything. Hi. You guys are absolutely disgusting, I want you to know that. I now have some spare ammunition. And if you go and toss it into the grenade launcher, it just swaps them out. So if you get a resident evil, that's what happens. You're not gonna lose your rounds. Here we go. Sherry, are you okay? Did you find your dad? Yes, I'm okay. But I couldn't find him. But I did find something else for you. Here! Here's another. Thanks, sweetie. Now, why don't you come over here? I want you to stay with me. Claire! reach the ventilation hole anymore. But don't worry, I'll find another way. I can take care of myself. Wait, Sherry, come back. Sherry! Sherry! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. Yep, so there's the parking lot. But we're not going to the parking lot because of the game. Thank you. Double thanks. Alright. I'm gonna swap them out because the acid rounds are more powerful than the grenade rounds. 
Alright, with the club key... Okay, you know what? Yeah, I've still got a little bit of time. I'm going to store my acid rounds just for now. get knocked slightly back behind the corner. There we go. Down, Fido. Alright, so, autopsy room. I am more than likely going to use some grenade rounds here, just because. Ow! Would you not? That's rude! Oh, I'm so glad you got caught. Oh! Nope, nope, stop! You're gonna let me do the heels! Why does she get the worst ones? Okay. Then I already went there, so I come into here. Ba -da -ba -da power to the card reader is off. Oh, right! I forgot to do the puzzle in here. Duh. Smack the head, smack the head, smack the head. I forgot to do the puzzle. There we go. can't believe I forgot that. And I just ran through it with Leon, too. <laughs> ADHD rank over. There we go. Hmm. Pistol ammo. Pistol ammo. Acid rounds. Machine gun. Worth it! Alright, time to go back up. We have stuff we gotta grab. But because Buddy Boy shows up, we'll equip this machine gun. Now this machine gun, if you were to play in normal mode, you actually receive it right away to start. Kind of like a, uh, I guess a handicap, if you will. And over here we have Night Watchman's Diary, same one. More acid rounds, yay. Do you have anything on your body? No. Didn't think you did. I'm going to take care of the club key, and that's where I'm going to end this one off, because we might as well. Yeah. 
Um... Yeah. Okay, now I know where I'm going. It's easy to get turned around in this game, I swear. healing on me? I do not. This could be a really bad move for me. Ah, crap, I need the lighter. <laughs> Oopsies. At least it'll give me time to grab the stuff I need to take on Big Boy. Which is how I will start out the next episode. So I'm going to quickly go, save my game, and then at the beginning of the next episode, I'm going to be in that room with the stuff that I need. Why? Because, yeah. I think I don't really have to run all the way to a save room. Alright, so first we do that. That. I'm just gonna do that for the time being. That. Because there's another green herb, I can do it as a double in case Big Boy hits me. And yes, I will be removing the ink from my person before I do anything. Yes, we're totally saving. So that's, that's, that's all. All the keys are used, we've met Chief Irons, and we're getting close to the second half of her chapter. So, I will see you all next time. Bye bye